What's up, everybody? Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm Biscuit Dog, and we're still at World's End. We're trying to escape, though. Okay, so I've got some plans. Our last plans kind of went awry pretty badly. I forgot that you couldn't set up camping beds in somebody else's territory. I mean, at our tower, that's fine, but our tower is all the way over there, so that's not great. Uh, before we get started here, I'm using the same three mods as always. If you're interested, go look down in the description. Everything will be there. They're all great, and you should get them. Okay, so... Here's the, here's the new plan. Everybody's kind of on hold, just hiding behind this building. Ooh hoo hoo hoo. We gotta keep a frosty eye. Hey, who are these guys? Those are probably mercenaries? Who are you guys? Mercenary captain. Man, we could use your help. I wonder if we should hire these guys to get out of here safely. It doesn't look like anybody's in the immediate vicinity. And I think I could probably get their attention. It's worth a try, man. Okay, let's take somebody sneaky. Hunting squad, Brom, where are you, buddy? You, we're gonna unhold you. We're gonna sneak you. I'm gonna bring you up here. Okay, let's see if we can talk to these guys. Actually, let's not sneak. Let's just talk as quickly as possible. Hey, you! Oi! <laughs> yes, I'm here for business. I'm looking to hire some bodyguards. Toot sweet. 2,000 cats per day, one day minimum charge, no refunds. Okay, two days, 4,000 cats. It's a steal. Everybody, let's go back behind the building. Okay, we just bolstered our party by five grisly mercenaries. <laughs> so that's bound to help. Um, maybe we could send the mercenaries? They're just going to bodyguard us. We're not going to be able to send them anywhere. All right, let's try this out. They're probably going to help. Wow, that was that was pretty lucky, I think. I mean, we could probably do it without them. In fact, we may be able to get through the gates without even being noticed. We got in without being noticed. So maybe we should just uh, we should just try our luck and see if we can get out without anybody noticing us at all. Um, all right, let's make a run for it. I'm not going to run too far out of the gates just in case they do notice us. Then we're going to we're going to be in a world of pain. They're going to notice us. I mean, we've killed the whole town. Yep. What was I thinking? Come on, mercenaries! <laughs> Earn your pay! Green's what I like to see. Okay, you guys, beat them down, beat them down, and let's get out of here as quickly as possible. No, you, don't over here. We don't want any of those things. <laughs> don't say over here. Oh, are we clear? Are we good? Can we get the hell out of here? Let's roll! Who's, who's still alive? There's one still alive. Where is he? Who wants beef? You. Hmm. Who are we gonna sick on this guy? Keeper, where are you, buddy? Alright, Keeper, you deal with this. Would you? Ah, good. Good mercenary. Yep, yep. Not so smart now, are you? Yeah, that's the way I like to see fights go down. Where are you guys going? Uh, we don't want any more trouble on purpose. Oh, I see. The mercenaries are hung up out here. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was a good choice. I think it was a it was definitely a good move to hire the mercenaries. Yes, this is karma free too, I believe. I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, Shadan or anybody who knows, but I suspect we're not getting bad standings for doing this because it's not us doing it. <laughs> We all out alive! It's amazing! Oh no, it's not gonna last long though. Let's roll. Let's roll. Yes, the mercenaries tied them up brilliantly. I don't care if we never see these mercenaries again. Let's face it. Uh, thanks for the help. Turns out we're only gonna need you for the one day. <laughs> Alright, you guys, finally, we get to head back home. Let's get the hell out of here. So Shidan suggested that we join the Flotsam Ninjas. I can't... I can't remember if we have or not. We've certainly met them a bunch of times, but I don't think we've joined them. Uh, and I think it was because they had uh, they had beef with people that we didn't have beef with. But I don't think that's going to be a problem now, is it? Really? <laughs> so if we run into them, uh, we're totally going to join up. We need allies. Any allies we can get at this point.
these look like they may be flotsam ninjas. Cannibal hunters. My buddies. <laughs> One of the few groups of people that won't attack us on sight. Okay, we'll leave them alone. It does look like we've got a little encampment down here. I wonder who these are. It looks like cannibal hunters, but you can't be sure until you check. Cannibal hunters. Okay. Uh, let's check the map. I'm pretty sure there's a flotsam outpost here somewhere. Yes. Alrighty. That's gonna be great. Hopefully there'll be somebody there who wants to chat with us. Ah, yes, good. This is like their main outpost as well, so... Uh, this should be the place that we can join up with the flotsam ninjas. So, they've got some residential buildings, they've got an armory... Power station... And a faction HQ. That's probably the place we're looking to go to. Let's go speak to these Flotsam Ninja and see if we can find some more friends. Bone Dogs. Food. You want to try us, Bone Dog? Hmm? Ah, oh, it looks like it. Alright. Let's do it. Uh, that was easy. Okay. That was pretty easy. Where's Saru? Uh, she's being carried. Okay, Brom, you carry the stakes for now. There we go. That's all we need from you. That's all we need from you. What? We're cool. Okay. What's the problem? We're cool, man. We're cool. What are we talking about here? Is it gonna go down like this? Must we kill you all as well? <laughs> um, we're here to talk. Can we talk? Yes, we can talk. Okay, let's uh, let's put down the pack beast. Where are you, dinner? Let's put you down. Let's send Rat Boy as an envoy. Ah, stop right there, brother. My comrades have you surrounded and they're ready to kill. You're heavily outnumbered, so I suggest you cooperate. Tell me who you are. Man, what's with the third degree? I'm, I'm just an adventurer. I don't want any trouble here. I don't think that's any of your business, lady. <laughs> just a holy nation Acronite on a pilgrimage, milady. I don't think that's a good one. I'm a merchant. I'm looking to sell some supplies. I'm not any of these things. I'm just gonna have to say, what's with the third degree? Maybe... I'm, I'm just an adventurer. I don't want any trouble here. Well, adventurer, you're trespassing on private land. Guess you discovered the wrong place at the wrong time. See, we're not too keen on people knowing our business here, so give me one reason why I should let you live. Ooh, we should probably be quite careful here, because trying to kill us would be suicide. We have supplies, food, medkits, weapons. Hmm. I'm a doctor. I can help tend to your wounded. I wonder if that's gonna work. These people look like they've got a doctor, let's face it. Oh, they're all they're all trained on us and stuff. We can't we can't survive this fight. Uh, I'm a doctor. I can help tend to your wounded. We have plenty of first aiders here already. Whether you've got a good stock of medkits though, now that's another story. But last of all, before I let you go just yet, I need you to prove you're no Acronite lackey. Swear on the Phoenix. Swear on your guard that you are truly what you say you are. I swear to Ocran, on Phoenix life, I mean no harm. Uh, okay, let's do it. Okay, I'll be watching you closely while you're in my neck of the forest, got it? Uh, thanks, I guess. What is this place, anyway? The less you know, the better. Forgive me, I'm not overly talkative around strange men. Alright. Well, they didn't kill us, that's a plus. We didn't join them, though, either. We're gonna have to speak to this lady again. Can we, can we have another chat? Stop right there, brother. Oh, we get another chance. Good. What's with the third degree, man? I'm the one asking the questions. Last warning. Speak. Ugh. Oh, okay. Well, she wanted medkit, so let's try. I'm a merchant. A merchant, huh? Lucky for you, we're running low on stocks at the moment. Courtesy of the cannibal hordes killing off our regular suppliers. Oosh, tell me about it. <laughs> Where do I start? You'll find trade points inside the village. Do your business and leave. But before I let you go, 
Just yet, prove to me you're no Ocranite lackey. Okay, well, I swear to Ocran on the Phoenix life, I mean no harm. Okay, I'll be watching you closely. Okay, whatever you gotta do. Alright, let's get in here. See if we can find somebody else to talk to, possibly. Ah, a, a kind of friendly city. Even though we haven't joined them yet, they're not trying to kill us. That's a step in the right direction. You two, get in here. Do we have a bar? Any... Any, uh, any recreation to speak of? This is rather a dull town. Ocran has abandoned us. I betrayed my holy brothers. What have I done? What have you done, man? What have you done? Okay, we can speak to this guy. A man from outside the holy lands, huh? Tell me, how has the village been treating you so far? Well, they're not the friendliest bunch. People keep to themselves here. I like it that way. Yeah, that's, that's probably a good one. Let's just say many of them have uh, trust issues. Can you blame them after the way they've been treated by their own brothers and fathers? And what about you? Don't you feel the same as them? Ha! Me? I've traveled enough since leaving Stack to know that no man or woman is trustworthy. But I'm looking to travel again. I guess you always appreciate that which gets taken away from you. And for me, that was my freedom. Which brings me to my question, traveler. Are you hiring? My feet are itching to roam free again. Well, knife, it just so happens that I may be. How much are you charging? Well, I'm seasoned enough that I can handle myself in a fight. I'd like 6,000 cats to send back home to my mother and stack. After that, I'll happily follow you for food and security. Wow, they're, they're real quick to just sell themselves into servitude around here. 6,000 cats? We've got like 140-something thousand cats. I think it's fair to say we can afford you. Paid 6,000 cats. Good. All right. That uh, has been pretty productive already. What about you, Slim Jim? Speak to this one. I'm looking for recruits, of course. Are you for hire? I am, but not for you, Drifter. I'll serve no man. I served men long enough when I was living in the Holy Lands. Uh, that's awkward. Okay, so <laughs> I guess if we were a girl, then maybe we could hire her? I don't know. Hungry Sally, get over here. You've got some convincing to do. <laughs> Excuse me, madam. Okay, so that's unfortunate, you guys. For some reason, I'm not able to hire any more people. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably, I'll probably uninstall and then reinstall the 256 squad limit mod. So I'll probably reinstall that mod and see if I can get it fixed again. Maybe. So I'll probably reinstall that mod and see if I can get it fixed again. Man, I paid her 12,000 cats before my dumbass realized that she wasn't that she wasn't joining. That's inconvenient. Well, at least we didn't spend all of our money. So I'm not going to try and recruit anybody else out here right now. But uh, maybe we can sell them some stolen goods. Let's go. Let's go speak to the shopkeeper. Shopkeeper. Yes, good. What have you got? Welcome. Are you looking to buy, sister? I'd like to trade. I'd like to trade, if you please. What have you got? Spring bat. Man, that looks cool. <laughs> it looks like a shotgun. I like it. Hmm. 34 to 48. I know nothing about crossbows yet. Ooh. We're definitely buying that. Okay, crossbow blueprints. This was a good choice. Yoink! And... Nodachi, we've got that. We know all these things. And uh, we could always get more of those. Man, I wonder if there's a blueprint for crossbow bolts. Old World Bow, Mark 1. Hmm. There's a lot of different crossbows. This is super intriguing. So these are the crappest. 11 to 21 damage. Not great. 20 to 30 damage is the Ranger. Then the Spring Bat is 34 to 48 damage. Hmm. We can make spring bats now. Okay, that's good news. I wonder now. Fencing chance 100%. Looks like they'll buy our stolen goods. So let's sell them. Yes, very good. We don't need two Nodachis. That's just crazy talk. 2,800 cats. That's grand. All right, looks like we can uh, looks like we can do some trading here. So I'm going to get rid of the bulk of my weapons, just in case we run into anybody else on the way home. Then we can pick up more loot. When I say get rid of my weapons, I mean until all her money's gone. So she's got 22,533 cats. Uh, that should be gone pretty quickly here. Let's bring one of the big traders in. Wall, get in here, buddy. 
Okay, Sally, off you go. Ah, yes, let's trade. Good, 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 good. I have many things to sell to you. You can have that. You can certainly have that. You can have that and that. And that. And those. That too. Even that. That as well. <laughs> Things are going pretty well for the old bank balance here. Okay, back up to 149,000. So it wasn't s such a costly mistake after all. I mean, that was stupid. I don't know what is going on, but uh, we've lost Skinner and now Knife twice. So I've really got to fix this mod, you guys. If anybody's got any ideas, just please let me know. Um, there's nothing else I want to sell you. Do you have any more? Yes, let's take those. We'll take all of them. How much did we just pay for those? 121 each. That seems pricey. Oh, are they stacks of 20? Yeah, stacks of 30. Okay, those are stacks of 30. That was a pretty good purchase, I think. 151,000 cats. Not bad at all. Are we going to sell that? No, that's a pretty good ninja blade. We're not going to sell that either. It's Nodachi. 0 0.97. Eh. See ya. Okay. That's pretty sweet. We made some money. Uh, we didn't really make any friends, but we didn't make any enemies either. All right, rat boy. Let's head to the HQ and see if we can speak to anybody in here. Nowhere in this world is safe. People are either trying to burn us at the stake or they're trying to eat us alive. But at least the cannibals are good for one thing. Target practice. Uh, that's not right. Cannibals are... No, 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 no. That's not our stance on cannibals. Target practice is all fun and games till you find yourself boiling in a cooking pot. Uh, the truest words I ever heard. Anyway, you're here in my space, so I guess you want something, huh? Ask away. I've got nothing better to do until my next target drops by anyway. Are you the leader of the Flotsam Ninjas? Here we go. Can I join the Flotsam Ninjas? Well, in a world of fire and happy religious zealots and flesh-eating nudists, we can never have too many allies. Swear your allegiance to me and your defiance to the Phoenix, and I'll make sure my ninjas are always ready to protect you. Together, we can take down the Holy Nation. Now that's the kind of talk I like to hear. I swear my allegiance to the... Huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Relations with Flotsam Ninjas improved by 75. Look at that. Fast friends. Flotsam Ninjas are now your allies. Thank God for you guys. Man. Relations with the Holy Nation decreased by 75%. The Holy Nation are now hostile towards you. Uh, news flash. They were always hostile towards me. What's my standing with them now? It's, it's not going to be any different. I surmise. Minus 81. It seems about right. <laughs> okay. For now you're one of us. Now go forth in your slaughter of holy nation lackeys. Spare the innocents, but show no mercy to the paladins, the priests, and more importantly, that old cretin Lord Phoenix. Hmm, good. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, good idea, Shadan. That was pretty good. We made some cash. Uh, we bought a pretty sweet crossbow and some pretty sweet crossbow blueprints. So I'm happy about that. Uh, I'm trying to get as many Kenshis out as I can right now because honestly... What else do we have to play? This is way more important than everything else, you guys. So I'm trying to get another one out this week. Uh, I hope I can do it for you guys. I think I'm going to leave this one here for today, though. Thank you very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace!